video, I'm going to show you some different ways to flip these straps for the Vanna Bralette. The Vanna Bralette straps are quite thin, and with the elastic in them, it makes it more difficult to flip. So there are three different ways I'm going to be showing you. The first one is probably my favorite, but I understand that not everybody has this tool in their sewing room. This, I think it's actually a medical tool, but it's one of my favorite tools for in the sewing room. The way that I do this is I stick it in the opening. All the way to the other end, open it up if I can, stick the serger tail in, clamp it, and then gently but firmly pull. Once it gets started, it's quite easy to keep going. And you have your strap. The next method involves a straw and a chopstick. A boba straw would work really well for this. Push the straw all the way through. And then you want to get your serger tail and your thread into the hole. And then you keep pushing it through. And there is your finished strap. One of the best things about this method is that the seam is always in the back so when you attach your straps the right side is always the side that is up. The final method and probably my favorite is creating a long serger tail. With the serger tail you put it inside the strap. You want to place it all the way into the corner because you will be sewing along this edge and you don't want to sew along the tail. With the serger tail method, you slowly but firmly begin to pull the serger tail. Once this end starts going in through, you can continue to pull the strap right sides out. This is a great method, but it requires you to remember to make the long serger tail when you're sewing.